Well, finally, Mother Nature, yeah, I'm talking to you. And we actually got a little weather coming into the eastern Sierra. Kind of a good thing. Let's go to the weather map. Sierra Wave Media forecaster Dennis Mattinson says, we've been talking about a pattern change for the end of January for some time now. That west coast ridge keeps us dry and above normal temperature-wise through Tuesday. However, then that ridge, ridge splits and flattens in response to a large system out of the Gulf of Alaska. Basically, the ridge gets pinched off in two segments, one pushing toward western Canada and the other drops down toward the Southern California coast. Mattinson says this will allow the westerlies to make a weak breakthrough. So a threat of precipitation in the Tahoe Basin north Tuesday night with an additional slight chance for Mono County Wednesday through Friday. Can I get a hallelujah? and possibly over the weekend. Dennis Mattinson says not a major winter event, but maybe a foot at Mammoth Mountain. We'll take it. And while all this is happening, the Owens Valley, Dennis Mattinson says we'll get some chance of moisture on Thursday. Low tonight into tomorrow morning for Mammoth, 21 degrees. Bishop and the Owens Valley right around 29 degrees. Mammoth, June, Mono County on Tuesday. Partly cloudy skies, some light wind. 57 the high in the town of Mammoth Lakes, low of about 23 degrees. Wednesday, all right, partly cloudy with some west winds, 5 to 10 miles an hour kicking up. 58 the expected high in Mammoth. Low of about 25 degrees. And it's about time. Thursday, 70% chance of some rain and snow for Mono County. West winds, 5 to 10 miles an hour. 45, the expected high in Mammoth. Low of about 16 degrees. Tuesday for the Owens Valley, mostly cloudy conditions. Some light wind. 71, the high in Bishop. Low of about 30 degrees. Wednesday for the valley, partly cloudy skies, some northwest winds, 5 to 10 miles an hour, 76 the high in Bishop, yikes, low of about 32 degrees. And there it is, a 30% chance of some rain on Thursday for the Owens Valley, some west winds, 10 to 15 miles an hour, 64 the high in Bishop, low of about 24 degrees. So we'll cross our fingers and hope that, uh, well, that precipitation actually falls and uh, we're going to get some snow and rain here in the eastern Sierra because gosh darn it, we need it. A couple of sports notes here. I'll let you know about in celebration of U.S. Figure Skating's National Skating Month, the Mammoth Ice Rink has some promotions for its Great to Skate open house on Friday coming up this January 31st. Now this week, the Mammoth Ice Rink has scheduled a week-long series of events, including an introduction to youth and adult hockey, discounted skate sessions, and a chance to win skate passes and Mammoth logo wear, culminating with a it's great to skate open house and again that's going to be Friday and then the inaugural winter youth hockey classic taking place on Saturday. Now beginning at 2.30 p.m. kids can participate for free beginner level learn to skate sessions and youth 15 years and younger skate free with a paid adult admission. Now this week long uh, celebration all the scheduled events online check it out at mammothicerink.com. And just a note here about the VCs, the Village Championships and the Mammoth Mountain Race Department kicking off the season tomorrow at noon. You want to sign up at the Mammoth Mountain Race Department. That's at the main lodge at Mammoth Mountain. A whole lot of fun is to be had out there, not only racing but the after parties and whatnot. You want to participate in four events, you'll get into a drawing, maybe win some great ideas. Items. More information, anything to do with the VCs, the Village Championships, you can contact 760-934-0642. That's going to wrap up news and information for us here on Sierra Wave TV. You know we're part of Sierra Wave Media. You can hear our radio station, 92.5 FM, 96.5 FM. Streaming on our website, sierrawave.net. Have a great evening, everybody. Good night.